Well, good morning. Welcome back to Not Just Stuff. We've got some tidbits left over from yesterday, and we're hoping this box isn't empty. We are! <laughs> and she is. Oh my gosh. We've been out, and this is like the third neighborhood we've been through, and we've seen like mattresses and empty boxes. It's pretty dismal today, guys. I hope something changes, or we're gonna have probably the fastest scrap day ever. But you never know what the day holds. So let's get after it and see if we can find some junks. And just like that, we've got to the North Pole. Santa Mayo and a health rider. Ooh, how do we pick this one up? Like this. That's that bike I was gonna save for my kids. None of them want it. So it's gonna go. This is made in the USA. Onward. Back on the TVs. Let's see if we got a good enough date here. All the way down there. Let's go this way with it then. Uh, come on, bro. Where are you at? Don't fail me now, eyes. see one well <clears throat> if lose out we'll see if he wants to test it otherwise she's going because I don't see a date ouch come on lay all the way down We got a quick possible two for here. We have a, a bike with some metals in the garbage. This will be steel. I think this is a garage door maybe. I don't know what this is too. I think it's a garage door thing. Doesn't feel long, thick enough for a garage door. I don't know. I've seen it before, whatever it is. All right. There's that. Let's go see what kind of tidbits we got over here in this box. Got a mirror waiting to break. Ah, oh, it's just one, just one little piece here. And this guy. Oh well, they are metals. All right, let's roll. It's not much, but I think I saw some copper back here. Come on, be copper. It is. <laughs> I know it's not much, but that's actually uh, a nice find. I don't find copper very often. Sweet! Finally have some real scrappage. Don't be disgusting. Oh good, you're not. Shink. Put you back yonder. Ah, oh, bee lights. Bush lights. Oh, yes! Beautiful. I really get in here too. It sounds metally. You can go in there. You can go in there. You can go in there. All right, we'll take this guy with us. Go up front while this car goes by. Oh, 
All right, onward. What's that? Oh, there's towers in the trash can? For sure. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Hey, you have a great day. I appreciate you. Let me throw you my cards. You have it. I come by every week, but I don't mind running over here if you uh, if you have some stuff. Stuff and just call you feel free to give me a holler and i can swing by and pick it up right, thank you, hey have a great day we're starting to find our stuffs now in a big old lounger what we got in here what kind of cable is this is this you know, it's gonna be probably coax come on bro dogs behind that garage door hey a pair of clippers Ooh, this is light could you be aluminum possibly oh these still work I remagnified my trailer yesterday I'm all stocked up on magnet that is aluminum Onward. Road always has me blocking things up, but we're getting all this stuff. This is a treadmill, maybe some kind of exercise equipment. It's got to go. This one almost looked like a computer. It's not, that was just the board for it. Oh gosh, you're a heavy piece. Yeah. Exercise piece number two. Now that we've put it in here, pretty sloppily we'll find ourselves our uh, refrigerator let's roll possible Christmas picker hopefully all these boxes aren't empty but they do look kind of uh, empty yes they are all empty except for this guy Get some Christmas trees Got some towels. Are you guys empty or full? I think this is all full. Ah, I'm gonna have to dig. I'm gonna have to dig. That I don't think's any good. The trees can go. I never looked at those DVDs yesterday either. What we beat before, guys? We don't need this looks like garbage. I don't need garbage. Those weather tacks. Think you go to my car? What kind of car you got? A suburban. Tahoe. Not my car. That's paper. I'm trying to see if these guys are down here. Are you guys in here or are you guys just empty boxes? There's an empty box. And I think these are all empty. So we'll take the lights. Is that a wine sweater? 
Those are probably brass. Whoa, not make a mess. Mats. I think so. That's it. All right, you guys can be my carrying, my carrying lid. Bunk bunk, bunk bunk. Oh yeah. Eh, not a true picker, but a picker nonetheless. Onward. Alrighty guys, we've made it to the yard. Not a great day. We actually uh, ended up going back to the storage unit. All these are from the nitrogen makers. I finally got them all apart. As you can see, not much, not much. So we went and took all these apart and we didn't, uh, do our computers when we were there. We should have done that too. But I didn't want to take anything out, so we did get all these apart though. Which really frees up a lot of space in my storage unit, which is amazing. I did stop by uh, Lou's and check that TV. That TV did work, but it, again, I don't know why it doesn't count, but it lights up, but it doesn't count for some reason. Those are pans from the home. We're getting rid of. We got too many pans. And those ones aren't in very good shape either. Ah. We might get that, it's little, but. I'm excited about that right there. Look at all the brass. I'm gonna finally turn in some of this brass. Sud, how you doing, man? Alright. What's that? Trying to make money. Yeah. It's a nice piece right there. <laughs> My one guy that gave me the nitro maker, he has those tanks, they're all stainless steel. I I drove by and they were working in the unit but I hadn't heard from them yet and, uh, and I feel like they put different locks on it hopefully he hasn't moved out of that unit and I didn't miss him those tanks are probably I don't know 50 bucks 60 bucks a piece and he had a lot of them Hmm. 
to de-leg or not to de-leg? You just pull off, or are they? No, nope, they're screwed on there. Ow! Dude, my finger! What is going on here? in one of the two. Today's Tuesday. I'm supposed to race on Wednesdays, I thought. Must be practice. <laughs> Forgot a piece. Believe it or not, all the other crap we already started with in here. Except for this chair. So we're going to uh, assess some of this stuff before we go see Jeffy. These are all the motors that came out of the nitrogen makers. We got some brass, we got some motors. We still got all kind of junk up here. We had more Christmas lights. So uh, we'll catch you over at Jeffries. Bye world. Let's do some NFJ. Oh my God. <laughs> I am so tired. I am so tired. I am too, man. I went back, it was slow on the street, so I went back to my storage unit, and I've just been breaking stuff down on my storage unit all day long. That chop saw whooped my butt today. Chop saw? It's like a chainsaw, but a metal cutting blade. It, it's what, were you, what were you cutting up? The reefer cores. Why? Instead of melting it with a torch, uh, all that smoke. Yeah. Can you use one? No. No. They have one next door, though. Yeah, I got one, too. Yeah. I got one more. I got one more. One oh. more. One more. And then I'm gonna cut all the wires tomorrow. Yeah, they have. They have. Theirs are like. They have them just like stacked up. They're like. What? Craziness. What, like the ones in the yard there. Over there, they're like all the same size. They're not mangled at all. They're like just stacked well, up. This gets like, ripped apart. Oh, I know, I know. Machine. They don't have all that stuff over there. It's all, it's all handled by hand, so. And look, two more pallets right there. So I like this pallets. pipe, this pipe's nice. That's heavy. No, I'm sure it is. Yeah. Just like that, when, when, when you don't have the mail, uh -huh. to the left, you see a whole bin of copper left. I gotta do tomorrow. Same, same unit? Same unit. Well, both units. Yeah, well, uh, they're the same thing. Yeah. Oh. I haven't had time. Like it's been nonstop, and I've been trying to do that. And, you know. Oh, I know. Plastic. I don't know how it got in there. What? Yeah, it's still not horrible. No. <clears throat> I just don't need it. Shink. I'm just trying to get rid of stuff, man. <laughs> I just can't get rid of stuff, man. I mean, look at my trailer. This is like... <laughs> I've been trying to get rid of stuff. It just keeps multiplying, man. Your motor's ready? <clears throat> Right. Yeah. Those are all out of the... Dang it. There's some nice brass in here too. I was going to take it off, but... Look at that big mama jammer. It's a well pump. Yeah. 
Did I see Jacob here earlier? Yeah. Yeah. He only had like 95. I thought it was him. He said he only took the truck out last night. Oh, really? Well, I said, well, that's good for a truckload. That's from Kevin. That's from Kevin. What's from Kevin? That van? Yeah. He didn't keep it? Is that a fan? Yeah, that, that I'm gonna have to put a guard on. What kind of fan is that? Somebody used a squirrel cane. Really? Look at it. Oh my gosh. With a belt, with a belt to a motor. That's some, that's some ingenuity there. Yeah, it is. It blows? It blows well, actually. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> No, clean, clean. That's all clean, Jeffrey. Pretty sure what? Oh. Oh. I scratched it, bro. Well, this got stuff inside. That's why it's so heavy. What's that? It's got stuff inside. Come on, it doesn't have stuff inside. You're just making stuff up now, Jeff. Do you want, to, do you want me to prove you wrong? Yeah, prove me wrong, Jeff. Prove me wrong. <laughs> I got nothing better to do. <laughs> I don't want it. I'm scrapping it, bro. Damn. Look at that ball. Look at There's nothing. I, I, I didn't. I didn't know. I didn't say there wasn't stuff inside. Afterwards, you're gonna bump out. Hey. Here, let's leave it there and do it as dirty. <laughs> Usually, these are sterling. You ready? Yeah, right there. You're ready? Yeah. I wonder if any of those work. They probably all work, Jeff. They generally do. If you want to know what on twist them and stuff, that's the problem. What would you call Santa if he herded cattle? That's an easy one. I don't know. Jolly Rancher. Jolly Rancher. Why was the golden retriever so stressed out? Oh no. Because he has so dog one much to do. Dog on much to do. That's not very good at all, man. That's horrible. Where does Rudolph get a new tail when he loses it? Red light clearance at the retail store at the retail store <laughs> retail <laughs> what kind of tree has the most bark all of them a dog Outside. a dogwood tree 
<laughs> I've done that before. What did the spider do with its new car? What did the spider do with its new car? I don't know. He took it for a spin. <laughs> <laughs> what did Cinderella do when she got to the ball? <laughs> I'm gonna go with gagged. <laughs> Alrighty guys, we're weighed and paid. I know, where are we? We're at the Christmas post office. I had to get some packages out before they closed. Just made it. Woo! And I had some packages, but we'll get to those in a minute. Let's uh let's see how our day was. The day was pretty slow, but we did go back. Like I said, we went back to the, my storage, tried to make room for the trailer, broke down a bunch of stuff. A lot of the stuff is sorted still, uh, at the unit. I'm gonna, I don't know how I'm gonna get the trailer because it's still a disaster over there. But, um, I mean, was hoping a guy's gonna save it for uh, non-Ferris Friday, but I don't know. I might have to bring it in before then. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see what happens when it's time to put the trailer into the unit. But uh, let's dive into our receipt, see how we did. 10, 700 pounds, you know, well short. We, like I said, we didn't find much. Uh, seven cents a pound for $49. A yellow brass, I've been breaking down the brasses of what I've been doing a lot of. There wasn't a lot of it. It was just that one canister, but that one little can had 43 pounds of yellow brass clean. 210 a pound for 90.30. Man, it's getting dark out quick. Um, electric motors, uh, a bunch of motors. All the motors came out of those uh, um, nitrogen makers. Plus, there is, they were power supplies. And the guy uh, that was behind me at the yard said, hey, I got a well pump. Do you want it? I'm like, yeah. He's like, I just turned in a bunch of wire. I'm happy with what I've made. Go ahead, take it. You can turn it in. So I had to zip it apart because it was all cast iron, but that motor helped a lot. Uh, motors, 218 pounds, 26 cents a pound for 56.68. Irony Heavy was probably the bike. I don't know if there was anything else in there or not. And probably something else because it's 56 pounds. Uh, but it was basically uh, dirtier aluminum, 56 pounds, 25 cents a pound for $14. Clean aluminum, we had 34 pounds, 45 cents a pound for 15.30. We had uh, 26 pounds of Christmas tree lag. 26 cents a pound for 702 and then just that what those uh can holders that jeffy gave me a, a ride for my money on one pound uh dirty uh brass uh 110 a pound for 110 for a grand total today a 233.40 not bad seeing that the streets kind of stunk and before we get into our mail let's do our box because we haven't done our box i haven't updated the box yet but i owe 20 for yesterday because we forgot to do it yesterday and you know what i'm going to do another 20 today because that's about 10 percent of our run so we're going to put another 20 two 20s in there and i'm going to give you an update on the box the box is in here the box is there but it's just not updated so uh we'll have to uh, update that and um talk to you about tomorrow we got ourselves some mail from colette Mac, I think it is. Let's see if it's uh, written a prettier inside. Let's get myself a blade so we can get into this quicker and with less hassle. Hopefully there's nothing uh, that I'm gonna cut through in here. What we got, what we got. We have nacho stuff and mat. We got Mary, Mary, Mary. Oh, look, we got $5. That's going into the trailer thing, too. Um, hope all your favorite Christmas traditions fill your home with happiness. Wishing you and your family a happy, magical holiday season and a healthy, prosperous new year. That's a mouthful. Uh, P.S. The $5 is for the new trailer. Sorry, not more. Hey, no, it's, it's, it's all, it's, every little bit is plenty. Thank you. So we've got ourselves a letter, and then there's another letter in here. This one's might be, oh, this is for Jeffy. I was like, this one might be for the kids made it because it's got a lot of stickers on it. I'm guessing, uh, the, the, let's see. 
Mm, maybe the same handwriting. We got to give that to Jeffrey tomorrow. So we're going to give that to Jeffrey. Thank you, Colette. Uh, let's see if does she sign this one. I want to make sure I got your last name right. You didn't sign that one. You're like my kids. They never sign their cards. Um, I'm going to go with Colette Matt from o Oregon. Oregon. Man, that's... That's a, a mile away. And then I got another one the other day. I did already open this one. This one's from Jackie Kessling. She always sends me stuff. What we got in here. She sent me this little thing. It says, Lord, bless these we love with this Christmas day. Be there near and far away. Bless these good friends who mean so much and those whom we out of touch. We bring them all in to you in prayer and ask you to keep them in your care. That's a nice little prayer. Um, and then we have got ourselves a lot, our season's greetings. May every joy of yours this holiday season and throughout the coming year. Jacqueline Jackie Kesling. Hope you and you all have a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year's. And she sent me a bag of money. I'm, I can't read them. My eyes are too uh, too old, and they are. It's kind of getting dark. I'm going to guess they are 1981s, or I'm hoping they are. There's a 50 cent piece in here, I think. Oh, it's not. It's a. It's a. It's a. We got to get that one out. I think that's an international coin. There's some quarters in here. Let's see. Yeah, it's a peso. It's an un peso from Mexico. Is this a 1981? It is. That's awesome. Yeah. But there's some quarters in here. There's some pennies. I'll talk about it more tomorrow when we lay it out and I have better eyes where I can do it on my desk. But thank you, Jackie. I always appreciate it. Thank you, Colette. We better close this up before we get ourselves cut. So that's what we did today, guys. Thank you for the mail. I appreciate you guys. Thank you for taking a little bit out of your time today and spending it with me. Make sure to smash that thumbs up on the way out. We did not have a fan again today. Although, we didn't find much. So, uh, hopefully tomorrow is stronger. If not, we got plenty of stuff still back in the storage unit. And we have stuff still we got to uh, break down from the house. We have all kind of totes stored up from my hoard. We just need to get it processed and out of here. So... It's nacho stuff, but that doesn't mean you can't take someone else's trash and turn it into cash. So until tomorrow, be safe, be happy, and we'll catch you guys then.